All right, so I just wanted to talk a little bit today about Barry Bonds, and um, I haven't followed baseball too closely this year. I've never really been too into it. Um, I'm beginning to appreciate it and like it a little bit more in the last couple years. So forgive me if I get a few terminologies wrong. I'm, I'm still kind of getting into baseball, but um, I was kind of surprised when I found out that Barry Bonds wasn't on a team. Um, I mean, he has some advantages, believe it or not, even though he's 44 years old. I mean, he's still going to hit around 270, 276, which isn't great, but it's not terrible. Um, he's probably going to get you 25 to 28 home runs in a season. He hit 28 last year, I think it was. So, I mean, for an American League team, he's going to be a decent designated hitter if you need one. Um, I don't see a National League team picking him up because you don't want him in the outfield. He's too slow now. He wouldn't be any good. Um, but... I'm, I was just surprised, and I was kind of thinking about it, and um, they were talking about it on FSR the other day, and this guy said, or one guy said that team chemistry doesn't matter, you know, I mean, he's a cancer in the locker room, but that's not why people aren't hiring, people aren't picking him up because of all the off-court issues, um, off-the-field issues, excuse me, what I'm talking about is the steroid case. Um, you know, there's fear that he could go to jail. I mean, there's new indictments on him every day, it seems like. And there's, I mean, there's all sorts of media attention around him. Um, I obviously think that that's one big factor, but I think that um, team chemistry is a big factor in any team sport. Um, you know, maybe not so much in baseball as like basketball or football, but it's definitely a big deal. And um, when you have a guy that comes in, he's new to the team, and He's really standoffish and demands all this stuff for his locker and demands all this, 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 and that, as Barry Bonds has a reputation of doing, then, um, you know, what are you going to think of him? I mean, it's going to affect the way the rest of the team thinks of him and, you know, thinks of the management and there could be grumbling. I mean, you don't know. I think that that actually plays a bigger factor than the off the field issues just because I think a team would still hire him, maybe for the minimum, just, just to get him out there and get him hitting because he's a decent designated hitter he would be and you know you might take the risk of him having to go to jail but you know it might be worth the risk you might put that in the contract or something I just I don't see that as the main factor to me so like I said earlier I don't know too much about baseball so give me your guys' opinion let me know what you think um, I'm also going to be out of town for from the 15th to the 25th and I'm not gonna make another video before then because um, finals week is just killing me so um, just let me know what you think if I don't comment. It's because I'm busy, and I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can.